nice noodles. The singer in Max Rebo's band. And, well, she looks in a pretty good condition. There's a little worn paint here on the underside of her lips. But besides that, it doesn't look like there are worn paint. limbs are fine. Yeah. So, no discoloration. But she's missing her microphone stand. Okay, let's note that. seem to be any discoloration. And his limbs, they're fine. His head is a little tight. Solo in Bespin outfit, and he's missing his plaster. There's some worn paint here on his bottom, on his hair, several places, a little hair on his hand. Then his 
a little worn here on the upper part of his back. little bit of miscoloration on his helmet, mainly the front part. It's a little yellow. He's missing his rifle. It's a little bit worn on his hands. on his shoulders. Here on his bottom. The orange emblems are also a bit worn. But yeah, his limbs are fine. are a little loose. Skywalker in Hoth battle gear. He is missing his rifle. It seems like the limbs are a little yellow. Then there's blue discoloration here on his knee. There's one paint on his boots, obviously. And here on his pelvis at bottom, on his tunic up here, on this binoculars, and on the, the scarf or what it is that's around his head here. Some paint mistakes there on his neck, chin. Oh, and the paint has worn off a bit here on his holster for his plaster. Missing his 
limbs are fine Missing his white staff. So he has quite a few areas where the pain has worn off. Several places here on his trousers and not up here on his hip. There's also some scratch marks, dents, and up here on his shoulders. His arms. His belt. Yeah, and his hair. Eyebrow. His limbs seems to be okay. Missing his stuff. His worn paints on his trousers. Okay. So this 
Blessing Blaster. And one pain on tools and heels. Gloves. And wrist. And then some paint splatter on top of his head. Besides that, he seems to be in okay condition. Let's have a look at the next one. Okay. Here we have Admiral Akbar. And he's supposed to have a black staff is missing. He has some paint that has come off here on his vest or whatever this is he's wearing. And he's rather, he's a bit scratched here on his back. Don't know if that's visible on the video. And then there's paint that has come off here on his sleeves. There's a mark here. Different scratches and marks all around. Also a bit on the legs and on the bottom. Paint worn off on the bottom. Also on these their bags or what they are here on his hips. And there's a bit worn off here on his left eye. His right eye seemed to be okay. Limbs are okay. All right. So missing staff. One pain on his tunic. Several places. And his paint splatter on his arm. and dents and so on. So he still seems rather dirty, even though I've washed him. So let's just note. Yeah, it seems like this one has seen some action. So, one paint Some that has come off here on his shoulder On the eye This eye as well, I think The middle one seems to be okay Then we 
have paint here. Seems like a mistake. I don't know. seems in pretty good condition and his limbs are okay pilot and well, he's missing his plaster so let's have a look there's some paint that has worn off here different places on his boots Same on his hand, both hands. The black here is more or less intact. There's some paint mistake there, it seems, and a dot up here. Also, a small dot here on his belt. few dots on the back and his head all well, his face seems to be intact there are some paint that has worn off here on the sides and the back also a little bigot here up in the hair, but not much. So on the limbs, yeah, they're fine. Let's see, he's missing his plaster. This is Anakin Skywalker in ghost form from the original Return of the Jedi. This figure doesn't have any accessories, so nothing is missing in that regard. some paint that has worn off here on his 
tip of his fingers on both, both hands. A little bit here on his cloak, on his chest, stomach. Also down here, a scratch or something. limbs and his head. Seems. And, well, the worn paint, his head seems fine. There's worn paint here on these protruding things on his armbands. little worn here on his, mainly just here on this right bracer. There's little paint dots splatter. Here, a piece of plastic seems to have chipped off. Hip, I don't know, belt. <laughs> 
thing has come off. an X-Wing pilot. And his left shoulder this goes all the way over here. So his shoulder is on the back is broken a bit off. Which leaves his head a bit wobbly. hand is that from some suit or something from a candle don't know okay and well his head his helmet is supposed to be white so that has turned yellow the emblems are somewhat intact, but the red line is, well, it's sworn. Paint has come off several places. And, well, on his boots, some white markings, and the paint is worn off at the bottom here. And the paint has worn off here on the white on his back and on this black thing that goes down here on his bottom. And the white on this, not so much on his left leg, but here on his right leg, this white ribbon. And then, as usual, on the hands, Paint has come off several places. Now his limbs are well, the legs are fine. This arm is okay, this one isn't, but that's mostly due to. Well, that seemed to help a little. But the arm is still a bit loose. Gotta be careful with this one. He's missing his rebel blaster. So let's take a few notes on this. So we're missing blaster and worn paint on boots and helmet. White West and white ribbons, and then on the black on this bottom, and then we have discoloration of the helmet, which has started to turn yellow. This broken thing should know that as well, even though it's mostly clicked into place. So, on the back, there's a crack. And this right arm a little loose.
accessories, which is this hat head piece, this bag, shoulder pouch, and his staff. So let's just have a quick look at him. So his limbs are fine. And perhaps there are a few marks here and there that hasn't come off in the cleaning. Not many. And his eyes and teeth are intact. A few marks up here as well. Down here. On his pelvis. has worn off a bit on his toes. Okay, let's note that. So, one paint on the toes, and then some small dirt. Besides that, he's fine. I think he's pretty good condition. So. There we go. Max Rebo, the piano player, and well, right off the bat we can see that his torso is a different color than his limbs and his head. And the paint in his eyes are worn a bit away. I don't know if this is a scratch mark, it seems like. And his limbs are fine. Yeah. What else? There's nothing much to see. So have his accessory. This piano organ. Which he plays at Jabba's Palace with his band. So let's note the few things. also worn a bit here on all these golden ones on his piano. Let's note that as well.
So this is the Ewok Wicket from Return of the Jedi. And his limbs are fine. He is a little bit worn on the paint on his nose. Also a little bit here on his belly. But besides that, he looks pretty fine. Oh, a bit here on his cheek. But besides that, he looks fine, I think. No discoloration. And we have his hood, but we don't have his spear. Missing spear. And one paint on nose, cheek and belly. Two. This is Han Solo in trench coat, and here we have the trench coat. We don't have the Rebel Blaster. So, the limbs are fine. We have a little worn paint on the boots. Not much. And a little on the hands. Again, it's not much. Just a tad. And then a little on the hair. And here on his behind. So here on the belt buckle, here on the front, there's a white scratch mark here on his vest. Also a few scratches here. Back here on his on his hair on the back side. Okay, let's note. So he's missing his blaster. And one paint on boots. Hands, just a little. Hair and belt front and back. Let's see if we can get this coat on him. There's a big tear here in his... on his right side, right arm of the, the trench coat. Princess Leia Organa in combat poncho, which we have here. We don't have the belt, and we don't have the helmet, and we don't have her blaster. Okay. This leg is a little loose, not much. It is rather tight. Okay, let's see. Better worn paint here on her boots. Not much. And then here on her hand.
little here on her hair. But besides that, she's in a pretty good condition. There's a scratch mark over here on this arm. A small spot here around her at her waist. So let's note that. So missing the helm, belt, and plaster. One paint on hair. on her, but well, we can't keep it in place with her belt, but there we go. Here we have the ATST driver. He's missing his indoor blaster. So there's one paint here on the knuckles, the hands. So a little inside the hand here, and then down here on his boots, tip of his toes. A little here on the heels, and on this buckle here. Oh, and the back side on the gloves. On the belt. A little on the nose. There's some paint splatter here on the helmet. Here as well. The emblems are more or less intact on both sides. There doesn't seem to be any discoloration. And his limbs are fine. Belt, no. 